All right, welcome back. I'm just here replacing the blower motor. What's going on there? Um, it's one of these apartment air handler. Just uh, basic. They're actually pretty, quite easy to do. So what we're going to do is uh, let's hop up on this water heater. So we got two screws here. kind of tricky part here. So you see we've got three screw holes here. I'm just going to go ahead and the trick with this is you've got to on this last screw you've got to uh, time it perfectly because you got to catch it. So as I'm unscrewing this I've got to So as I'm unscrewing this, I've got to catch this motor before it falls. So I'm holding it, holding the motor, and I'm unscrewing this. What's going to happen, the motor's going to drop out, and you don't want it to drop and fall in this slab coil and blow it out. So I'm just going to... Sometimes you're going to have to go ahead and bend it. Where you're coming in at. You can always bend that back. So we're just gonna bend that down. And now we we'll try this again. There it is, screws out. Okay, then you see this motor now just pointing the little slide out. Boom. There it goes. So it's on the coil now, just resting there. We're just going to go ahead and pop our harness off. A little warm. And we're just going to gently position our coil. Okay, so there we go. Coils out. I'm just going to take this outside where it's a little bit cooler. Careful. Okay, well he should have just have the nitrogen, his nitrogen attachment, basically. Yeah. Okay. Alright, man, Let's see. Okay. 
pass. We got those three, got those three screws out. So now what we're going to do is simply give them a little adjustable wrench. And then pop the set screw loose. I'm going to take it all the way out, just loosen it. It's going to slide right out. Perfect. Same motor. Hey, these motors, man, don't last at all. Hopefully this is the right size. Yay. It's just kind of spinning with us, so uh, kind of hold that like so. There she goes. Go ahead and take our slide this down. The mounting bracket. Transfer it over. and even everything's even I always like to make sure that sucker's spinning perfectly. No wobbles. Crispy and clean. Tighten up our set screw.
Beautiful. Good to go. Better put back in. Okay. So it's going to be pretty tricky getting it in as well. A little more tricky getting it in than it was getting it out. But it's not a, not terrible. I'm just going to opposite effect. drill pre-screwed. Let's just go ahead and run that screw back in here. and get one in which I'm about to get it here it is So we got all that put back. Now we're just going to reconnect our harness. Done. Hit the power. Good to go.